Skincare and makeup. Mini road trip. Little village. It feels like spirited away. Tris, we're. Guys, well, I hope Bimo's coming. Hi, <laughs> Bimo. <sighs> we have not have been. We are and will be in like ultimate editing mode, pretty much all week. So right now, I'm working on the finishing touches for our 10 year since we've been dating anniversary, like Q and A, like relationship advice slash personal mm -hmm. things. Uh, by the time you guys see this video, this video will be already uploaded. Yes. <clears throat> and today, Kyuho is going to be in subtitle hell. Oh boy. Because it's like 25 minutes long. Please do Kyuho a solid mm -hmm. and watch that video. We'll leave it like in the description box somewhere because he works really hard in the subs for those kind of talking videos. Yeah, it takes like eight hours. Yeah, no joke. It really does. Yeah. Had to finish off this one. And then we actually have to send like the draft for this vlog in the middle of this week. And at the same time, we're also editing for our Kangnen project, the travel videos. Mm -hmm. There's going to be like probably two. So yes, it's going to be fairly busy. So today is going to be like, you know, a little bit of an indoor day. But we're thinking of going somewhere out tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Just kind of like break up the monotony of like editing a lot. Yeah, that's pretty much the plan for this week, I guess. Right? We've literally been editing all day, aside from eating lunch. So how long did it take you to finish those subtitles? Seven, seven hours, a little over seven hours. After dinner, I have to start editing other video. Yeah. Oh Kangang. boy. Yeah, Kangang video. I didn't even touch it. Yeah. Oh, there's a lot of footage. Oh. I'm just thinking about it. Like, <laughs> I was taking a break reading. I'm reading Crying in H Mark. I just started. So far, so good. Yeah. Mm. I just, I want to take a nap. Oh, I know I can't excuse me. Mm. All right. Um, are you hungry? I mean, I'm getting there. I'm oh. going to have to have something. are getting ready to go out it's a beautiful sunny clear day out there we don't want to waste it for a second Kyuho and I are getting ready I'm gonna do my skincare and a bit of makeup I want to thank Medicube for sponsoring this video it's an awesome Korean skincare brand derma cosmetic brand that I love and I've been using for the last several months for the next few months I'll be working with them and once a month I will choose and share with you guys one product that I really love from them and this month, it is this one, Deep Vita C Ample. So if you haven't been using some form of vitamin C in your skincare routine, I highly recommend implementing that. It helps with anti-aging, hyperpigmentation, fading dark spots. Whenever I get breakouts, my skin usually takes kind of a long time for the red marks to fade. But since I started using vitamin C products in my skincare routine maybe about four or five years ago, I noticed it heals and brightens that area a lot quicker. Out of all the vitamin C products I've tried, I know this is sponsored, yes, but honestly, this is personally the best one I've ever tried. This has 13.5% vitamin C content in there. And no, it doesn't just come in this little bottle. Aside from the effectiveness of this product, the second thing I like most about it is it comes like 
this. Can you see that? It's this box. So it comes with like the little stopper and three small bottles. The biggest downside in my opinion of vitamin C products is they go bad really quickly when you open the product. But with these, there's packaged in much smaller compact bottles. So when I'm out of this bottle, I'll just take the little nozzle off like this and pop it on to one of the new ones. So it's always fresh and really effective. I think it's such a smart idea. It's genius that they did that. So it looks like this it has this lovely thin milky texture to it. I usually just do it in three spots. I try not to let the dropper touch my face. And then I just, yeah, it's very thin, very easy to spread out on your face. I don't know, when I put this on, my face feels so hydrated and silky. It's just amazing. Yeah, it's already like, perfect. It's already absorbed. Yes, so highly recommend this stuff. It's fantastic. I am going to finish off my skincare and makeup. So we'll see you guys in a bit. Okay, we are in the car again. We have Kyo's mom's car until the end of the week. So we're gonna take advantage of the situation. We're gonna travel somewhere where it's, you know, a little farther and harder to get by public transportation, which is rare, like, you know, in Korea, because pretty much everything is connected in larger cities. Mm. Where are we going? Namansansong. Mm. It's like a fortress in Gyeonggi province, yeah. and we're gonna- I always wanted to go. I've never even heard of it until you told me yesterday. And it's like perfect place to go in fall. Yet another mini road trip. like a little town. I didn't know there was like a little village here. Try to find a parking spot. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. Wow. This is so pretty. I had no idea. Yeah, like it really feels like we went back in time, guys. All these restaurants. Because like everything is traditionally built. Okay. This whole place, as soon as I was driving by, to me, I said, it feels like Spirited Away, that like village. And then like, I heard that they're playing that song in the cafe. So everyone definitely knows it's kind of that feeling, right? Yeah, yeah. Wow. This is Naman San Song. It says it's 460 meters above from the ground. This used to be the kind of fortress where kind of protecting any invasion that uh, the enemies can go through and go to Seoul. Yeah, that's where we are right I now. I thought it was just going to be a fortress wall, not all this. And hey, look, there's a cute police station. What? Really? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Sarah's busy just taking pictures, filming B-rolls. <laughs> I feel like I'm on a movie set. I'm having so much fun. Well, we're actually gonna eat around here. I found one spot. Wow.
like side dish here is bomb though. This one? Yeah, it's like crispy and like a little bit fermented in soy sauce. So like the harshness is gone, but it still has a punch. Oh, yeah. All right, originally we went that way, but they're under construction, so we're gonna go to a different area this way to see this supposed view of Seoul. There's so many makgeolli places here. Is this like a place to, you know, <laughs> celebrate makgeolli or something? I think that because uh, all these restaurants have chun. They go well together. Yeah. I feel like I'm in like another country slash era. It's yeah. very interesting. Yeah, around this area, there, there are no apartments. No. All these traditional houses. It's very refreshing. Yeah, it's not that far from Seoul, this place. No, it isn't. Yeah, it, it only took about 40 minutes from our yeah. place to drive. Now we are heading to the west gate. And from that spot, we can actually see Seoul. This place is magical. There's so many cafes that I've seen here. I feel like we're gonna burn all those samgyetang calories off in no time. It's a lot of uphill. Now, I love to bike, man, but I am not good at hiking or like climbing hills, like anything with an incline. It's just not my strength. I mean, it's not that far from here. These are some of the biggest Korean pines I've ever seen. Oh, there's a small Buddhist temple up here. It's way up on the mountain. There are actually a lot of temples around this area. Almost there, right? Yep. Like a much needed walking break at that temple. <laughs> oh. What? You can actually go through it? this place. Look at the wall. Oh my god. Oh. It's our city. Can you see Namsan over there? Yeah. Namsan Tower. You can see it. Yeah. Look at the tower, Namsan Tower. <sighs> Guys, look at this. Isn't it awesome? There's 10 million people down there. <laughs> yeah. It's unfathomable. Yeah, the air quality is actually really good today. I think it's just like a bit easy. Look at the plane. Oh, yeah. Yeah, guys, if, uh, if you want to come to Naman Sansung, you guys can also use the subway, but you do have to walk quite a bit. Yeah, and then maybe take a bus. Yeah, there's also a bus. Obviously, a perfect way to come here is by car. came all the way down. This is the middle section of Naman Sansong, I think. And Sarah wants to see all these small villages. Hello.
think this is just a neighborhood mixed with houses and businesses. I am gonna go check if this is a guest house or something. All right, now we're gonna head back to the car. We're gonna go back home, right? Back to reality. Yeah. From this fantasy world up here. <laughs> Back through the tunnel into the real world. 